the Chinese Air Force made an unexpected move in Europe. Six Chinese Air Force Y-20 transport aircrafts flew into Serbia, delivered undisclosed high-value cargoes. The six largest Chinese military transport aircraft stopped at Istanbul and then Bulgaria and then reached Serbia, landed in Botanica Air Base. After unloading the cargoes, it flew to Belgrade to receive fuel, then returned to China. It is unknown what cargo the 6Y-20 delivered, some analysts believe that would be the latest anti-aircraft missile system from China, the FK-3 medium to long-range missile system. Contract between the two countries was signed in 2020. It is a very unusual move of Chinese Air Force. Previously China had been using civilian cargo aircrafts to ship weapons to foreign buyers, but this time China decides to use 6Y-20 military aircrafts. The shipment is likely to include six launcher vehicles, one target tracking radar vehicle, one search radar vehicle, one command vehicle, one power supply support vehicle, and supply vehicles. It is possible the six planes shipped a complete FK-3 missile battalion to Serbia. Serbia might have ordered to two battalions of the FK-3 missiles in total. The Y-20 aircrafts appear to carry fully loaded countermeasure launchers, packed with flares and chuff to block enemy sensors. This is also a rare move, as in most peacetime missions, military aircrafts won't need to carry them, only American military planes flying to high-risk areas need these countermeasures. It might be a sign that Chinese Air Force prefer to prepare for all scenarios in this mission. Serbia and China have not released any details of the cargo. Another possibility is China delivered combat drones to Serbia. As early as 2019, it was reported that Serbia had purchased nine Wing Loon 2F reconnaissance and combat drones from China and planned to purchase 15 more. The Wing Loon 2F is one of the best combat drones from China. However, even before this contract, Serbia has received a batch of Chinese CH-92 air reconnaissance and combat drones. The CH-92A is not as advanced as Wing Loon 2F, but still it is a lethal combat plane believed to have better performance than the famous Turkish TB2 drone. Starting from 2020, the Y-20 aircrafts have made quite a few important overseas missions. They have shipped medical and humanitarian supplies to Pakistan, Southeast Asian countries, Russia, and Tonga. They transport Chinese troops to participate in the Caucasus 2020 joint military exercise held in Russia. These missions have become milestones of the strategic air transport capability building of the Chinese Air Force. The Y-20 mission to Tonga is also impressive, the island nation is in the South Pacific, far away from mainland China. The Y-20 took off from southern China, covering a distance of 9,000 kilometers with two stops, setting a record for the longest flight of the Y-20 fleet. Recently Chinese military sent a Y-20 fleet to support Shanghai COVID effort, shipping personnel and medical supplies to the city. In just two or three days' time, a few Y-20 completed shipping thousands of military personnel to Shanghai. At the peak there were more than six Y-20 landed in the city. And less than a day later, the Y-20 fleet completed the mission to Serbia in Europe, flying distance is 7,500 kilometers. More importantly, the flight mission covers multiple countries, including NATO member countries, it is proven now that China is capable of projecting its strategy airlift power to European countries, not just Russia. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, share and comment. It will really help us developing this channel and bring you more videos about Chinese military news. Thank you.